The reason why we organized this conference is because there is a huge potential uh, in the use of geodata applications for smallholder farmers. And we depend for 70% uh, of our world's production of food on smallholder farmers. So therefore it's extremely important that they are going to be financed. We need to mobilize local financial institutions uh, to look into agri-financing. And because the 13 NPM members, the Netherlands Platform for Inclusive Finance, invest over 3 billion euros in 90 countries. We have quite some leverage with those investees. Bank for Food is about increasing productivity, it's about distributing food, nutritious food, and doing it three times a day. So that's a big challenge because a lot of people go hungry today. So technology and innovation is key to increase yields. So today, talk about geodata, using our space to give information is key. So for me, in my view, if we want to increase productivity of the world by at least two times, data and innovation is going to be the future. Today at our conference, uh, Geodata for Inclusive Finance and Food, we launched a board of inspiration under the guidance of Prince Peter Christian van Oranje Nassau. Uh, this board is to promote access to financial services for smallholder farmers by using geodata uh, applications. The representatives in the board will be from Rabobank, FMO, the Dutch Development Bank, a civil society organization and the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. It's a big world with big data. There are many innovations in the field of satellite information and ICT applications. But how can we use these innovations to achieve financial inclusion and food security? Meet Joseph Mbatsia, a coffee farmer from Kenya who wants to grow his business. We have been having problems with the climate changes and we have not been able to farm as we are required simply because of climate changes which are not regular. We have an application that we have in our phone and we are able now to get the climate changes from the satellite. So we are planning now to improve the amount of water, uh, the quantity of water at the top. We need a good pump which is able to pump a lot of water. Uh, financially we need a lot of money, about 500,000. Geodata applications help farmers like Joseph with precision farming. He receives weather information and advice on which and how many seeds or fertilizers to use and when to irrigate his plots. Using these applications, Joseph can increase his yield and improve the quality of his produce. NSO is uh, responsible for stimulating applications of uh, space uh, earth observation. So it's very important to connect to the users because they know what they really need. And on a day as today we can connect to users in agriculture and in, in banking. So it's for us very important to have this opportunity to connect with all those people who uh, are going to use the information in the future so that we know what they really need. A bank always looks at two things, transaction cost and risk profile. Um, in terms of starting with risk profile, precision farming decreases the risk profile for smallholders, for farmers in general. Uh, it's more efficient allocation of resources. Um, secondly, transaction costs are also uh, decreased for banks because monitoring information provision to the bank becomes much more uh, easier and automated. The satellite information has not yet been made available to financial institutions on a large scale. But when it becomes available... Welcome. Yes. We were actually expecting you. Okay. How is your to catch a business? Uh, doing? Uh, I'm doing well. And I've received the information from uh, the satellite. Oh, you're using the same app, right? Yes. Uh, I'm actually using the same, same. What? You can see I've already have the information. Uh, so I was actually okay. expecting farmers to start streaming oh, in there. Yeah, it's good. That is yes. why I've come here because now I was coming for the room. Yeah, from uh, the records and the information we have, yes. you, are, uh, you qualify. Thank you. And therefore, you we will be able to loan you. The applications based on satellite data allow farmers to produce higher quality and quantity yields. This makes them a lower risk customer for the bank. 
financial institutions are then more likely to finance farmers like Joseph. Equity Bank is trying to conduct um, literacy uh, courses for the farmers and to show them where they can get adopting data that they will be depend on. Next to an investment loan, Joseph signs an agreement for yield insurance. That's okay. So, Mr. Mbatia, that's all. Mm, thank you very much. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, say hi right to all. I will do. Uh, thank, thank you very, you very much. much. Well. The added value for a bank is that farmers are more likely to pay back their loans. Farmers have lower risk profiles, as with the use of these applications, their farming practices improve. It's a win-win situation. In the Green Coffee program in Vietnam, farmers get access to special information. Information about soil, about weather, about rain, uh, but also about prices, uh, prices forecast, and about good agriculture pra practice. And this increases their yield, it gives them higher income, uh, they will use less water, uh, and there will be less pest and disease. This information is delivered via geodata and uh, combined with um, data from the field uh, based on SMS and an app. We also think that it's very useful to connect MFIs via the app to farmers in the field. So then they get information about the credit worthy of the farmers. Uh, are, are they um, worth to get the credit and via an app they get access to this, to this information. That's good for the MFI because they have less risk and good for the farmer because they have access to credit. That's how we think financial access and this program can work together. It's important because insurance gives him uh, a basic uh, uh, continuity for his uh, uh, farm in order that he can, in cases of emergency, he, he won't go bank bankrupt and together with all his financial products, he can insure himself for his future. And that's why it's so important. Hello. Okay. Ah, uh, yes, I've received the information from the satellite and I'm going to send you the rest of the information. Ah, yes, Andy. It is now possible for a financial institution to easily keep track of its clients' performance and compare this to general market information. Banks and farmers each receive different information and advice based on the same satellite data. Together with other information sources, this is combined on online data platforms, financial institutions, farmers, companies, governments and other actors can all access the platform to provide and collect data and advice relevant to them. We at UTS work with about a million farmers worldwide to promote better and more sustainable farming practices. Uh, one of the things we're doing is building a data platform that has a lot of information about the farmers, the farms and the conditions in which their crop is grown. I'm sure this data has a lot of potential to be used by the financial services sector to provide access to capital, access to insurance and other banking services. We studied around 250 cases and one of the big takeaways was that we have to make technology accessible for small farmers and tuned to their needs so that they can work with it and understand it. Secondly, also the rural organizations who are really in the remote rural areas, we have to take them along on the digital highway, not leave them beside. And then, what we saw also is that laws and regulations follow the innovations and that's a bit of a problem because we need to ensure privacy rights, transparency and such things. And then last but not least, we have to work together with all of us like space organizations, farmer organizations, organizations that never meet each other now have to really work together to make things happen. And I think that's the key message from this conference. Information from satellite data is now available to everyone, everywhere. If farmers and financial institutions connect, we will achieve financial inclusion and food security for all. So, let's connect.